everyone, it's Elaine, and I'm here today with a few friends that have come to hang out with me at the Pine Cone Cabin, and I asked one of the ladies to bring these books with her, and it's a special treat, and I want to tell you about them, and I want to show them to you. You won't believe it. Um, back in August, it was, one of my friends from Ohio, Miss Pat, had brought greeting cards and she had assembled them together so it was like preparing them for a journal. It was the coolest thing to me and I never really forgot about it. And so you've heard me talk about Kathy. She's seen, she's been in some of my videos with me showing some of her goodies. And the other lady here locally, her name is Fran. Unfortunately, her husband had passed away and she has been given all kinds of sympathy cards and kind of wanted to do something with them and wanted to um, keep them all together and preserve them and appreciate, you know, the fact that everybody had reached out to her in such a kind way. So this is them. So I want to show you what Miss Pat had showed Kathy and I and what it is. This is, um, it says needlework fabric and it's like for cross stitch and I don't know if I can yeah here we go it's pretty good on the camera you kind of pick every two spots or every spot whatever you want to do you you get your rhythm going and that's where you sew the card in so each greeting card is a signature all right that's important to understand so let's do the little one first. What Miss Fran did is she sewed in, as you can see, there are two different sizes, kind of filling up my camera here. There are two different sizes. So this is the smaller card, and it is covered actually with some upholstery fabric that I had. So we used what we had, and this is some ribbon that I was given. And it beautiful? So here we go. Now I'm not going to flip through all of these because they are personal. Oops, I have it upside down. They are personal. And the cross stitch fabric, let's see, can you see it up under there? So all the cards are stitched there onto that fabric. And then that fabric was glued down to the chipboard that's underneath of here. All right. So then the upholstery fabric was wrapped onto the um, cardboard, the chipboard, just like normal. And then a piece of construction type paper cardstock was then put in the covers um, for the front covers and I remember this was the first time these had been done any of us had done them had taken part in them so as you can see there's burgundy thread there where she stitched it in as well and again I'm just gonna you know these are personal just so that you can see and here you go there's the, the signature is sewn in so each card is sewn in and isn't it nice it's a nice way to have all of your cards together and then what Miss Fran did and again I'm not going to show you but she wrote their address their name and their address on the back of each card she took it off the return address of the envelope so it's all there together and so then here's the big one here's the one with the big cards in it we'll untie that real quick and again the front has the, the cover page as well as the back. All right, and it is sewn in. And then all the cards are stitched in. Okay? 